I had to request a new warm basket of bread. The low-key way to lose weight? Girl, you gotta get in the shower. <laughs> it is it is not what it's doing. Let me stop talking in third person because that's kind of weird. Let's just say that. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Give me some classic Christian obedience <laughs> from the wife. How about somebody left a dog at our mailbox? Do your research to find the one that you want that's perfect for you. Like a different dog. Shout out to a successful me Monday. Hello, Bill and Linda. Yes. Yes. You and me were meant to be as one. The universe has known it all along. Written in the stars, you and me forever. you guys happy uh what's today thursday happy thursday oh i just got out of the shower you guys so i did my face and everything beforehand a little bit of bts transparency i did my face you guys before i got in the shower and i was like i was like i'm gonna do a get ready with me and when i got done just thinking about that first when i got done i was like girl you gotta get in the shower Ordinarily, I would wash my face. Well, it depends. Sometimes I wash my face. I wash my face before I get in the shower. It just kind of depends on the day. You know, I'm thinking about the sequence of events and like the get ready with me. Like I gotta put on my face. And as soon as I got done, I was like, girl, you gotta get in the shower. You gotta get in the shower. <laughs> so it went backwards. So we're gonna keep it honest. We're gonna keep it transparent that this is what happens. Sometimes things happen out of order and then we edit it in order. So I'm not sure how you guys are gonna see this, but I'm gonna leave this in that what actually happened was I did my, basically, you know, I put on the, um, it's more so that it's okay to do your face before you get in the shower, obviously, but I put on this, what is this called? Flawless filter before I got in and I don't ordinarily put on makeup before I get in the shower or my lashes for that matter but I just had completed the whole thing and yeah so now I'm about to brush my teeth um and we will again out of order <laughs> I'm just all over the place but I gotta go now so maybe I should have done this on a day that I was not having to like go somewhere my braces are actually quite not I mean, they're tightened. They got tightened, obviously, not unbearable. Uh, but my my teeth are sore. So we had um, pizza last night, a pesto pizza, and I barely could eat it. Like I was eating just the toppings off the top because it was like difficult to eat the crust. Um, Jackie Hill Perry had said in <laughs> her Instagram and I actually said this to help you when I got my braces on. When you get braces and like Invisalign, if that is not 
really the low-key way to lose weight I don't know what it is because the way your teeth are sore like I'm, I'm assuming with Invisaligns like as you change trays you got to keep it in you can only take it out you know to eat but your teeth are sore even with braces it's like you don't even want to eat like you don't even want to eat it's like you're eating so slow you're chewing so slow yeah so it's you just want to do what you're supposed to do you know in the time you need to do it so you can get these things off but let me go ahead because i'm about to start rambling let me floss brush my teeth and then go and then potentially i'll see you guys later nothing much really going on at the shop i still have to call that plumber um and do our taxes that's what's exciting this week <sighs> Hold on. Hey guys, so hopefully this is not too bright um, right now. I'm getting ready to close. We are closing in less than um, like 30, no, 15 minutes. I just finished putting some curls in my hair. It's just tightening it up a little bit. Hold on y'all, this is way too bright here we go like we want real skin tone okay i just um plugged up my curling iron i shop <laughs> curling iron and put some some barrel curls in here just a little bit just just a little bit i don't have any combs i don't have a brush or anything so i used i finger combed with my new nails um let me turn the music off hold on y'all Oh, Quetta just called me. Y'all, hold on. Oh, Lord. I have the phone on sign. I mean, I have my earpiece in my ear. Why didn't it ring? Hold on. First of all, let's turn off the music. Now, let's call. I don't know why. I missed her. I missed her call. <laughs> I'm sorry, I missed your call. I have my earpiece in my ear, but why it didn't ring, I have no idea. It's nice. It's a process. It was a process. Okay. It's, I, I, <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Bye bye. I'll probably still get over there on time. Are these people coming in here, y'all? And I may have to pick y'all back up in a second. No, they're not. Okay. I transferred the data or, you know, the footage from earlier today. And right when I did that, I saw that my mic was not plugged up. Okay, I had to check it again. Uh, make sure I pushed it in. And then I, when I put it, you know, when I listened or pressed play, it's about three clips that you can't even hear me. Lori, shout out to you because, girl, I feel or I felt what you felt when this happened to you. Okay, y'all, I'm talking to talking to Lori Diva. Hey, girl, hey. If y'all not following her, what are you doing? She'll be linked below. Um, but, and so will Quetta J. Um, so yeah, I'm listening to it, or I'm looking at it, and I'm just like, wow. What I was saying is I need to run a Target and get some more of the little um, threading thingamajiggies to floss in between my braces. If you know, you know. I need to do that. Also, I was gonna, I said, I think that, um, my hair is on its last leg. We're just gonna fly through it. It's on its last leg. Um, and yeah, we, we're trying to maintain it. I think I, ha I 
I'm going to a concert. That's what I was saying. I'm going to a concert um, Monday or Tuesday. It's a double date with my my brother and sister-in-law. Um, and so I'm not going to be able to get my hair done because I go every two weeks, but I just skipped a week because I wanted to get it done the week of my birthday. So I'm just trying to hang in there. So y'all bear with my edges and all that because the, the, the blowout is not it's gone out it is it is not what it's doing so work with me and it's going to get worse as the week progresses because i'm going to the greenhouse to buy inventory next week and i think i said that to you guys last week not too sure but i'm doing that and the humidity in there is crazy you know once i go in there i'll be in a hat i have one more hair appointment after my birthday and then my hairdresser is going to be gone and so i gotta figure that situation out but i think i'm gonna do i need to find a braider so i was also saying that i need to find a braider to do some box braids because you know what y'all let me be packing up because we close in uh five minutes lord have mercy what was i saying oh no i just closed my bible and didn't put my little red my page marker in here oh what what book am, i mean what chapter i'm in deuteronomy okay chapter 28 oh so y'all can see i have this red tassel can y'all see the red tassel well, i have a few hanging right here but the red because i'm in the old testament i feel like i wish i had a red letter bible for all when um, god spoke but anyway i put that in there as a page marker to let me know like where i'm at so i just did about um i might have done six chapters here today i'll show y'all another time i think i did two four six i may have done six or seven chapters today um anyway what was i saying oh yeah so i need to find a braider for um who does like box braids because i made up with my previous temporary braider um god humbled me i apologize all the things and so um but i'm not gonna like reach out to her still right now just because i'm just not uh and then my regular braider my og braider she had uh, reached out to me recently probably about a month ago and told me she was in town because she lives in florida and she comes here to braid like um clients and i told her i wasn't going to get it right now because y'all know i wear those braids for like five to six months because we're going out of town for an event in toward the end of the year i can't share right now but you guys will see and i don't think that they're gonna want me to wear have braids in my hair so is this thing focused on me okay yeah so i will just probably do box braids i don't know if your girl's gonna be bold and maybe try braid her own hair is she gonna try it mm. let me stop talking in third person because that's kind of weird but <laughs> she is me uh but yeah i may try it i don't know i don't know but i'm looking for a braider here in atlanta who is not expensive af no i didn't curse but i just needed to say that for emphasis because i know they get ridiculous out here um and the price i pay my actual braider who does all those little braids that you guys if you've been here for some time know i get i pay her 350 dollars and my hair lasts for five to six months i'm not trying to pay 300 dollars for no braids that last me a month. just saying so there's that um yesterday was a rough day you guys when i tell y'all yesterday was a rough day i thought i almost lost footage like i thought that my external drive had clonked out basically and it was just a rough day and then once i had gotten home and um well once i went on google and figured it out and i got home and i had rendered in 4k because we render it in 4k um we are uploading in 4k okay it's all it's excellence we have the capability we bought all the we spent the coins to get the 
the equipment to give us the quality. So I'm giving y'all the quality. So this is actually my first time being here like for dinner because they only they open at five so you can't come earlier hubby wants me to bring him home the carolina trout so that'll be to go or is it the natural hot catfish child one of those salmon pork chops southern new york strip or vegetarian gumbo so i'm gonna give y'all your girl is about to switch things up and i'll talk to y'all about it a little bit later maybe in this vlog but soon um so that that meal would have been i'm glad to know that they have a vegetarian option let's just say that Okay. Into it, and then once you get familiar with that, mm -hmm. then you can go to Final Cut Pro. I might do that that comes free. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.
what you saying, Bar? We love you. We about to go. Good night, y'all. The crap out of me. Hey! Hey, Thank you for being so patient. You know what? I, I was just worried that I texted you. I said, I know. I said, you okay? Um, let me and see. you didn't respond. Yeah. And then I called see, you um, twice. He texted and you didn't me. Answer. And then. He said, can I, can I call you later? And can I call you later is the generic thing that someone who had kidnapped you and stole your phone with you. My wife wouldn't do that. You're right. I was, we were FaceTiming with Lori, so I'm This not the catfish, man. Yo! Is that the catfish? That look like chicken. No! You said... Oh, okay. This is the catfish. But don't, don't scare me. I I literally read what you sent me. Okay. You gotta heat. You wanna heat it up in the um fryer so it's not soggy. Pull the French fry liner out. Technology. Is that what it is? Does it taste like half That looks good. Like Oh, open the other side too. I guess I should have got the other one. Oh, the battery's about to go dark. Dead. Hey y'all, so I made it home. Brought hubby's catfish. Oh, you don't need a new one of these? Uh -uh. For the other side, you don't need to heat up the potatoes? I don't know. Okay. So yeah, we made it home. I made it home. I'm gonna text Quetta and let her know that I made it home and then I'll wait for hers. And then your girl's going to bed. She's gonna eat. Y'all saw Shadow, she got a fresh haircut. Ah, look at you! Look at you! Her pa took her to the groomers. Look at you! Yay! Ah. Oh, y'all hear Penny? Penny jealous, but Penny has been outside and she's in for the night. Yes. All right. I'll chat with y'all tomorrow. Bye. You said bye back. Mm -hmm. You said bye. Good night. <laughs> hey guys. Happy Sunday. It's the first day of the week. At least in my book, I always feel like the first day of the week is Sunday. What do y'all think? Is it Sunday or Monday? I think the first starting the week off with the Lord is day one. Oh, I need to get over. I need to get over. Who's gonna let me over? I appreciate you. Okay, I'm on the way home. I need to, I need to lotion my hands because you wash your hands so much in the cafe. Every, you know, if you take your gloves off and do something, you wanna wash your hands before you put them back on. And so I don't even lotion in between in there because it would just be wasteful. It would be wasteful. So, um, let's, let's get some, oh, well, let's focus on the road, holding the wheel. And, uh, yeah, but I have me a some leftover coffee. I had my first, is it, is it my first latte? No, I had another latte that the manager of the group made me like my first or second time serving. I think it might have been a little bit too strong, whatever they put in there, but it was okay. But the one I had today was a cookie butter latte that uh, one of the other young ladies who works, you know, who does the drinks, made for me oh my god it was so good it was so cute i'll probably insert because i think i did a story
cute. I almost didn't even want to drink it because it was so cute. I'm like, how do people drink after the creation of the little cute, you know? Oh my God, I was sipping slow, but it was good. Um, so yeah, I'm finishing up my coffee and then I got a free pastry. You get a free, free pastry. So hubby texted me and said he already ate some type of breakfast he'll be good until dinner so I don't know I think I might just make a hello fresh for dinner and and then we'll be good for the day I'm trying to think while I'm talking to y'all if I need to make any stops it's just in my feet you guys y'all already know when I stand on my feet too long it just gets worse and worse but I don't really have anything to do tomorrow other than no actually Penny has her um, groomer appointment at 9 a.m. So I have to get up early tomorrow. Maybe I'll find a Home Depot or, or something like that near wherever her groomer is. Because her groomer is in Bucky and, and then I don't have to stop today. That's what I'm going to do. That's exactly what I'm going to do. In the last vlog, y'all were in the comments like how my Me Monday did not end up being a Me Monday. So we're going to try again tomorrow. <laughs> Yeah, we got a couple of like administrative stuff to do and but all of those things can be done from home and I'll try to schedule those all around the same time, you know, in a couple of weeks or a month, whatever their schedule is looking like. So anyway, I just wanted to check in real quick and say happy Sunday. This is the... Ooh. Oh, <laughs> this is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. I'm watching um, a new YouTuber that I found through another YouTuber that I watch. Her name is Nas Bay. Oh my God, this road is so bumpy. Oh, I feel like I'm on a roller coaster. I need to get my bearings. So her name is Nazabe. Nazabe is an African YouTuber. I enjoy her content, you guys. She'll be coming across the screen. So you guys go check her out. She'll be also linked below as I usually do when I'm talking about anybody that I watch. But she did a video with another one of her favorite YouTubers. I guess they live in the same area. But they linked up and did a collaboration video. Um, about each other knowing each other and so I went and checked her out so I don't quite know her name because I've literally only watched like maybe three of her videos but I'll show you I mean she'll be linked below as well but I'm listening to her I listened to Nazabe on the way to church this morning because she usually drops on Saturday nights like in the middle of the night our time and it appears they probably upload about the same time on Saturdays or maybe the same day. So I'm watching her going back. Her video is much shorter, so I should be done when I'm done um, by the time I get home. But I want to go ahead and get off of here and finish watching her. And just, this is what I do when I'm driving. I'm either listening to an audible, y'all already know, or I'm listening to a vlog. Um, and that's a lot of times too why I may not comment all the time. Um, I don't always comment on vlogs to be honest with you guys because I'm always either listening while I'm driving and once I get to my destination or whatever I don't even remember what I thought to say in the moment. Sometimes I remember and go come back and comment but I'm watching. Um, and there's somewhere somewhere you guys will know that I'm I'm watching your videos. So but I don't think every, like a lot of people just don't comment all the time. But I'm either like listening when I'm at the shop and I'm doing something else. You know what I'm saying? So, but I'm watching. Christian woman and that girl is rooted in the word. And that's one thing that I love about her. That in as much as she is going through what she's going through, she is growing in her spiritual life. Notice. Brian, can you do it, please? Dollar Tree bouquet with the little Easter bunny pigs in there. Egg pigs. So I think that's for another video. I think that's just putting some of that Easter grass down at the bottom. Oh, let me 
turn the music down a bit. Get your foot out of there. Move it out. Get on my pillows and put on your knees. So you ain't hyper extended. But if you gonna be in here, why I'm gonna get your pillow? Because it's more important that your knees. Uh uh. Just do what I say, babe. Just put it under your knees. Okay. Give me some classic Christian obedience from the wife. And then these are the little Easter tree boxes for the cousins who are coming over. Look, I have my note bag here with all the dishes. So here's what I do the night before any type of hosting or situation. I like to figure out where But you can watch whatever you want. What do you want to watch? Because if I didn't put this on, I probably would have watched Ozark. I got two more episodes. versus trying to do both because I found that that just takes so much time and you need to spend like so I got my famous three tier food display that I always use and I'm about to Hey guys. Y'all my foot is swollen. Not well, is it swollen? It's very sore. Y'all just saw that I um put that machine excuse my hair I was laying down in the bed you know I put my foot in that massager just making a hello fresh meal this is the one I'm making hubby went to run at the um, wasteland y'all seen him do that before so I had him preheat the oven so I need oil oh my goodness my it's just my right foot my right arch uh oh my right arch you guys that's it very sore right now all right, so we got pink Himalayan, black pepper here. I'm not gonna be showing y'all how I make this right now just because I cannot maneuver this camera around enough right now to um, get all the angles <laughs> because my foot, okay? So y'all will see the after. That was too much olive oil. Oh, you guys, how about somebody left a dog in a box at our mailbox so we have like a central location mailbox i hate it i think i've talked about it on here before but like sometimes amazon or whoever will leave like <coughs> packages there if it's big obviously they'll leave it at the door but if it's small enough they'll leave it <coughs> They'll leave it at the um at the other mailbox, you know, for big for smaller packages. So we have a group ch chat group text for the neighborhood for the community, and so someone left, you know, posted in there a couple days ago. I hope y'all can see me. Is this bright enough? Let me see. Can y'all see me? Okay. Um, you know, is this your dog basically or does anyone know whose dog this is? It was like, what? It was just so sad. I like I didn't know what to really think about it because I'm like, well, maybe they put it brought it in the neighborhood because, you know, someone would obviously see it soon enough or whatever, but then it was like someone said they had driven when they went out to work. Um, I think this was yesterday at 7:45. They saw the box and if you see when I post the picture the dog is not towering over the box you know what i mean so i guess if you just kind of on your way out you see a box you think it's mail anyway <clears throat> let me put this in here y'all you probably think it's someone's package you don't think that it's a dog so obviously they said it um in the group after the fact you know they were like oh my god i saw that package this morning i did not know a dog was in there but the only reason why we we knew a dog was in there um is because an amazon driver went to someone's house i guess dropping it off saying hey y'all know there's a dog in the box at the mailbox so someone did call animal control and they came out and got the dog but oh they wanted me to put the vegetables <laughs> on the same pan as the french fries i can saute the vegetables yeah anyway so <clears throat> the bunnies are running around upstairs i'm like what is that sound um so they call it animal control or whatever um see i already have like my vegetables cut so we got some uh red onions yellow peppers zucchini and 
mushrooms. I've already, like I said, when I got home, y'all, I did all of this, and then I was like, <clears throat> I'm tired. I want to get off my feet. I don't feel like doing this, so I went upstairs, and I ate the um, blueberry muffin. Penny, why why are you gonna make that noise when I'm talking? <clears throat> When I told Eric, he was like, that's not how you do that. Why Why not just take the dog to the to the Humane Society yourself or whatever? But you just never know. If someone else found the dog who dropped the dog off and they couldn't get there. If somebody found the dog and they didn't have a vehicle. Someone just figuring maybe someone will. Y'all, I hate these lights. Well, I don't hate, I do. Because I hate recharging them. But I'm standing here and I have them on the sensory and it's like going out. But it's like, um, so maybe they were like, they would prefer to drop the dog off in the neighborhood somebody may adopt the dog and the dog not possibly be put to sleep because I think it depends on if you send your dog to like a kill shelter like that's the thing if the, if the dog isn't adopted within a certain period of time then that's what's going to happen hubby was like oh man I hope they don't you know put the dog down obviously we it didn't cross our mind to take the dog because we just got a dog and no one else claimed the dog so Here's the bread that they sent. And then there's a sauce that I've already made. And this has like mayonnaise, whatever that Italian seasoning is, a little bit of olive oil, salt, pepper, and garlic powder. But what I've been doing, I'm trying to slowly cut out eating meat just for a little bit. Um, so from HelloFresh, I've been ordering meals without meat can y'all see that oh my god this was so good so we've had that one but we have two flatbreads left a roasted garlic zucchini fajita and then a mushroom flatbread left and it's like mushrooms are a good replacement for or substitution for meat so it, you know that's easy and so is zucchini but mushrooms more so because you could still get like that meat meat texture i don't know what have you already ate he made himself a big old breakfast this morning without me i did feel some type of way like really dude you're just gonna make breakfast without me i mean he made a whole breakfast okay an entire breakfast like a whole breakfast like i really want to make sure y'all know i mean a whole breakfast because when he watches this again on the vlog when he watches this back i felt some type of way sir but anyway um <laughs> so i'm going to enjoy this hello fresh and then we'll probably eat something it's only like one we'll eat something again for dinner when we go to the rinse or something like that maybe possibly i don't know we're trying to like lighten up our foods or whatever so i'm about to start rambling let me go ahead and get off my feet because it hurts and i'll check in with y'all later because like do y'all see the dishes back here in this sink like this was not here this morning so he made like a whole breakfast without me guys so if this is what it turned out like i'm about to put the top bread on there but hold on y'all i'm watching kendra um i've never i don't know if i've had yellow peppers before but sometimes hello fresh will say like the picture shows that you should have 
red peppers which I like more or I like better because it's sweeter but they scent <laughs> yellow so we'll see what this tastes like I'm sure it's gonna be good because I have not gotten I have not received a hello fresh meal yet that I did not like so um, these potatoes don't look the most enticing because I got distracted vlogging and did not <laughs> line the cookie tray or whatever you call it or put foil or something like that or put the oil on the bottom so I had to literally scrape the potatoes off of the thing but I know they're gonna be good so we <laughs> we're gonna eat it so the other sandwich there to the left is for hubby if he wants it I'm only gonna eat one so yeah I'm gonna go and tear this up and take me a nap hey guys happy Monday it's Monday okay so is that who's in that car right there because that sure looks like my pop-pop's car in front of me <laughs> um I'm trying to put these I mean y'all don't see the sun right now but the sun is sunning yes it's a new day and your girl has on the shirt from yesterday okay leave me alone but no I'm just running out because it's real early it's not even it's like 8 30 running to get hubby and I some coffee because dang I wish I was able to see if that was pop-pop well it's not pop-pop probably my brother-in-law um hubby is saying that the coffee that we usually get oh let me fix this back y'all this is like the first time i've had glasses on since getting my ear pierced and i'm trying to figure out this maneuver this situation it doesn't hurt it's just new i haven't i haven't done it he said that the coffee is all of a sudden tasting tasting acidic to him i don't know um but anyway i'm doing a quick check-in uh so where i should have been heading headed this morning was to take penny to get uh her grooming get groomed because they both had appointments this week well shadow already went but penny was today but y'all y'all saw yesterday how i had to put my foot in the little massager you know um, my mom bought it for me a couple christmases ago and it re works really well almost too well but i don't know maybe my foot was just that sore yesterday so i was just in the bed pretty much all day yesterday letting it like just getting off taking the pressure off because it's just inflammation i feel like i gotta sneeze um so yeah i did not do anything and then this morning when i woke up i was still kind of just on it i mean it was still i was on it trying to see if it was okay but it was just not really letting up it's let up a little bit now it's like i probably if the appointment was at like 10 i would be able to go but obviously when you take your um your pet to get groom they want to keep them for like three or four hours so i was gonna try to go like to the coffee shop do some editing run some errands because we need some more skinny syrup or whatever but so i would be right back on it and it will probably be sore again this afternoon and i have my meeting tomorrow um my business meeting at the church so it was best for me not to do it hubby was like mm, yeah i'm just gonna read and just chill and keep you know keep the pressure off of it and then tomorrow i'm gonna take penny to the self wash we have a self wash which is what i used to do years ago with our shih tzu when we had um sugar she's with my mom you guys saw her a couple of vlogs ago um so she she's she was our dog and uh, we gave her to my mom after her dog Coco passed away who was a Shih Tzu as well we've always had <laughs> dogs we've always had pets my entire life I don't remember a time where I've not had pets you know even at my dad's house that's why we have rabbits because we had a rabbit at my dad's house so we've had birds okay we are an animal family <laughs> and my husband is now an animal family even though he is like he had to clean out the bunny hutch this morning and did not like it because it's my week we rotate weeks um hold on y'all i'll be right back we are back 
Um, <clears throat> I don't know what I was saying. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm gonna take um, Penny with me tomorrow. I just need to figure out how I can restrain her while we're meeting because since the meeting is so early, I'm not gonna be able to like wash her first. I'll have to take her after the fact, so. This morning was interesting. Oh, I don't know what my hair is looking like. I'm almost home, y'all. <laughs> I'm almost home. I'm just talking to y'all while I am. I'm just talking to you while I'm uh, taking this quick little trip. Wait till I turn, let me turn. Okay, this should be better. This should be better. But uh, yeah, I, hubby had to clean the hutch out. Um, and I had all intentions of doing it this weekend, but obviously I did not, so it was just overflowing. We rotate weeks, um, and he's really just been there. Like, I think I mentioned it in a vlog too before, like, when I bought Penny during Christmas holidays, it was right before he was about to take vacation, and I didn't even think about the fact that I co opted his holiday. So he really trained her, you know, with like going <clears throat> outside and all the things. He really did a lot of that and um, he had never done that before. I have, but I just, you know, I just didn't um, think about it. And as smart as golden doodles are, it's funny because I was watching a story from um, Makeup Shayla yesterday, last night or whatever she was talking about. She has a dopamine pincher, I think that's what her dog is called. And a lot of people were, you know, because, um, and I don't know if it's a he or she, so I'll just say they are so well trained that people always apparently ask her or say, oh, I want one, I want one, I want one. And she was like discouraging people from getting one because it takes a whole lot to get them where you want them to be. And that they also had to get professional training for for the dog. And so Hubby has already actually said that we may need to look into that for Penny because Penny is, a, um, it didn't take much for her to kind of catch on to go outside. It didn't take that, mm, it didn't take that long. So she's about 80% trained. If you can, you know, take her outside, she will, she'll go outside and there are times where she will hold it and like we'll let her outside and she but we you could tell you she held it but she's not all the way there like shadow like shadow is trained and a few accidents she's had more recently and by few i mean few we know that it is out of there being a new dog okay not because she's not trained because shadow will hold herself until you let her outside and penny's not there she's just not there we wouldn't trust leaving penny with someone and her not messing up at the house we would with shadow she has some behavioral behavioral I can't even say behavioral correctly with these braces, y'all. <laughs> because she's very clingy, very clingy. And Shadow is too, but it's just in a different way. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and end it here. It, um, just in a different way. So, but when, when Penny doesn't get you enough attention or whatever, she's going to howl and she's going to, what she does with us is she'll rip up her pad. Like she'll have like a little tantrum. So you got to like pick, it, it's something with finding the dog for you. You got to find the one that you're going to be able to, one, you're going to have to have patience with any dog, because especially at the beginning, because you're one, like, they're babies, and they are learning, you know what I'm saying, and I have to keep kind of telling hubby that, even though she's gotten so big, she's still a baby, so she's still learning, but they are, there are easier dogs to train, because Sugar trained like that, Shadow came trained, so... You know, but it's taking a little bit more time with Penny. So, if you're considering a dog, if you are a pet, a dog, mom or dad, you probably already know if you got them, like, as babies. But if you're considering it, do your research, okay? Do your research to find the one that you want, that's perfect for you, and that you're prepared to train yourself or professionally train, and that you have the patience, even for, like... 
in your house like because you know i showed on the last vlog or the vlog before last like they are teased so they may chew into the walls or whatever the case even the bunnies did that <laughs> Even the buddies did that, so it's like, mm. but let me go ahead and get off this car because, child, we could really have a whole conversation about that. Um, come on, okay. Well, I guess, oh, okay, the car wasn't on. I thought I just turned it on. All right, y'all, I'll talk to y'all later. <laughs> Best man, one. I mean, she got merch, but she got merch for the men? No, man, she don't. It's called a balloon shirt. Or oh, it's the kind of cut off at the waist? No, when you ever see me wear something like that? I'm somebody back mama. In the, back in the day? I mean, not like, but like high, and then you wear like a shirt under, like in the 80s. Oh, that's cute! Yeah, man, let me see. Oh, yeah, she gave me that in, in black. Yeah. I can rock that. Oh, that's so She got cute. that in black? No, only in this color. This is so cute. Is that is cute. Hey, y'all. So, we are making dinner. Hubby is frying us some chicken. I'm in charge of side items. Okay, so we're gonna just make some mixed vegetables and mashed potatoes. <sighs> Y'all excuse my hair, okay? It's me Monday. <laughs> we gotta try it again, but I've been, I've had a good Monday. I've, I've been relaxing. Uh, I took a nap during the eclipse. So, I did not experience it. Um, babe said that it got dark, but I guess my brain was like, girl, go to sleep. I love the vegetable season, pepper, a little bit of red pepper flakes. Ooh, that looks so good, babe. Then I also add a little bit of sugar, like just a little bit. And of course, butter. Gotta have butter. I finally finished Ozark. The rewatch. The rewatch, yes. Cause actually I'm starting my book this. Well, I already started the book. The book club book, I just need to like get more into it. So what do you have to put the show? I mean, I could put on the Golden Girls anytime. You already know that. I'll be happy if I mean, I can watch a little bit of Golden Girls. Golden it's Girls. Time to watch the Golden Girls. The Golden Girls, Monk, or Matlock. Those are my go-tos. They can just play, and I'm a happy camper. Oh, and I'm truly grateful for what I'm about to receive to nourish my body and my soul in the name of Jesus Christ.
Good morning. Happy uh, Tuesday. It is Tuesday. Where's my Apple Watch? Anyway, I'm on the way to my meeting. I just finished showering and putting my hair in a ponytail, which I never wear ponytails, you guys. I wanted to make sure my mic was on because <laughs> we messed that up the other day. Um, but yeah, I never wear ponytails. It's just not a thing I do, but it is pouring down raining outside. It's cute though. It's cute. It's pouring down raining outside and not Tom Ford ombre leather today. This is a nice, I think winter cool vibe, cool weather. And since it's rainy, that's the vibes I get with that. I'm going to wash Penny. Let me hurry up. I need to go wash. I'm going to the meeting. I'm taking her with me. I'm going to have the crate in there so she could be in there and out of the way of everybody. And then after that, I'm taking her to Petco to get so I can just wash her myself. They have washing stations. So we're not going to be out too long because I'm going to come back. I need to still repot the plant. Yesterday was a complete chill day. Shout out to a successful me Monday. I watched Monk all day. I took a nap. I slept through the eclipse. <laughs> Um, hubby made me some fried chicken and I added the sides. It was the perfect day, the perfect day, the perfect Monday. So today we got to do the things that we were going to try to do yesterday and then we're going to get ready for the night. Okay. That's what we're doing today. And I got to figure out what I'm going to do with my hair because it's raining and muggy and all the things outside. So let go. Okay. to go get a bath. You ready to go get a bath? Yeah, mommy. I'm ready. Come on, come on. We gotta get up here. We got all excited. We walked to the door. There's a puppy. We wanted to see if we can do the self-wash. Or you want to pay before after? It's a, whichever. It's, it's up to you. Okay. You doing stompers? Okay. You stop, stop. Hello. You doing stomping? Hey, you see. <laughs> oh my goodness, you're so cute. Is there a setup? Oh, okay. Thank. Okay, thank you. Go get clean. Go get clean. Okay. Come on. What's wrong? You gotta get clean. Penny. Oh yeah, sure. Right. So we gotta put her on the harness. I've been here before with my other oh. one before, yeah. I just haven't been here since you guys
Hey y'all, back home. Penny's running around here. I really want her pa to see her in this contraption that I couldn't figure out. <laughs> it's not slowing her down. She's running around with it. So I stopped and got us some dinner. I stopped and got us some Jim and Nick's. So we're gonna eat that. And let me wash my hands. Oh, I am tired. Hopefully y'all can see me. We have on our dining room light, which is like a soft light. When it's raining and gloomy outside, we turn that light on to set the mood. But let me feed Penny. She's already used the bathroom and pooed. She pooed and had an accident right before we left um, Petco. Y'all. That shampoo took my back out. That leaning over, oh my God. And because her hair is so thick, it took so much longer to dry her. Oh my God, it just took so long and she looked traumatized. I don't know if I got that footage or enough footage or a piece of footage, but the dryer is so powerful. Um, that it was scaring her I think she was just in the corner and I really hated it so what does that mean that means mommy don't miss my groomer's appointment hubby got some ribs some barbecue ribs and then I'm I just got me a pork sandwich look at this potato y'all oh my god I'm about to take a good nap after that I'm gonna take a nap. I'm gonna I'm gonna lay down and probably like relax for the next few hours. Anyway. Well we can't give Shadow I mean Penny any of this right here. Um, we're splitting it between Shadow and Penny. I just added Penny. I think I put that footage in here to um Farmer's Dog so she'll have her own food with the next shipment. This is frozen, so I gotta let this thaw. So for now, you're gonna get dry food, okay? You look so cute! You look so cute! You're so cute! Me. Oh, you're so cute! You say hi? You say hi! You say hey, Team Shining? Okay, Shadow, we'll pick you up in a minute. Oh my god. You say hey, Penny? <laughs> I don't know how to style her. She's just blown out. Like, come look at this. It's not what she did. It's what I could not do. I, this is all wrong. I'm gonna have to buy a new one. I mean, it fits her perfectly. I mean, she started gnawing at it, but other than that, it's good. You gonna say hi to her? I did with my touch. Really? With my loving arms. Shadow, you gonna say hey, Shadow, before I turn? Off? Every time we gotta go to the city winery, I don't feel like going. <laughs> you don't feel like going? It's the getting down there, the waiting in line. The Why you say you're not gonna want to eat? So you gonna have some drinks? Yeah, I'll have a drink. Come here, Shadow. Your name is not Shadow. Shadow, come here. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Don't scratch me, cause I know your nails are a little bit sharp. You say hello. You say hello. Say hi. You say hi, fam. You say hey to the fam. Don't scratch me. You say hey to the fam? Huh? No licking on the face. We don't do that here. Okay. Let me wash my hands again. So I can eat. You told me what to do and I did it. <laughs> there you go, mama. Thank you. 
Absolutely. Are we married or no? I, I brought that because I know that there was, you know I like my soda too and I wanted you to drink soda since I had soda last night so you could have soda tonight. I mean now. You know I've been wanting tea. Um, you can go to eat because I'm going upstairs. Now if you want to come upstairs, you can. Really? You going to leave these dogs down here with me? You going to go upstairs instead of eating downstairs with me? Okay, first of all, you can come upstairs and eat with me and the dogs can stay downstairs. But yes, I want to go upstairs and take off my shoes and take off my clothes and sit in the bed and eat and then lay back and relax until I need to get up. Okay, this is my Tuesday. My head dirty. It shouldn't be dirty, babe. Well, maybe it has too much oils on it. Let me hold you close to me. Yeah. We can make it better. Listen on. Can't believe you called my phone. You wouldn't even talk to me. A real life fantasy. And as a matter of fact, it blows my mind. You wouldn't even talk to a man. That matters in my life. All right, y'all. So I'm ready to go. I'm sweating a little bit, so we gotta we gotta get in the car so I can fix that. I'm trying to create like a bubble right here, like a big curl here. All right. Cool inside a party. Watching all the guys just bubble like hotties. They had a party that looked better than Ferraris. So I had the bodies. The only ones that answered. Nothing I said. I started getting fed and turning red. Then I told her just to get a box. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. What is it? Keep forgetting we coming to the back. Thank you. Yep, enjoy the show. So I hope you all have a blessed evening. I hope you enjoy every single moment of tonight. Take lots of pictures. Make sure you tag City Winery. Tell everybody I'm fine. Yeah, amen. Yeah.
Yeah. Are you ready for the artist? You know yes. Yeah. Let me see if y'all can do this again in unison. Who's the artist tonight? El Bonner. Damn, y'all good. Y'all moms will be proud. Y'all make some noise for El Bonner. <laughs> 